Hello everyone, welcome back, Severed is here, coming back with part, uh, you know, what? who cares of uh, what if Deku had half and half quirk. Now where we last left off, Izuku and everyone else has gone into the, uh, none other than the USJ to train on rescue missions, but nothing happened. The only thing that happened there is uh, they didn't actually did their, you know, rescue missions, but instead the villains attacked the place and right now Kirigiri is standing in front of all the students and of course Aizawa as after that. He, 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 said, he said that we are the league of villains. And before we get right into it guys, don't forget like, subscribe, my com, you know, discord down in the description and you know, after this maybe I'm gonna, st me and of course King Crisis, we're gonna start our club and do our series together which is basically will gonna be a surprise for now I will do the first part and the second part will be on his channel so I'm gonna uh, you know try to learn how to link his channel down in the description of my you know videos so you can watch his video if he you know just upload it later but right now let's get right into the video as right now Izuku standing behind Aizawa and immediately after that Aizawa tried to erase uh, of course Kirigiri quirk but he's made out of mist so this really didn't uh, help him too much. In the end Aizawa said 13 protect the student as 13 immediately opened her finger and starts sucking Kirigiri but immediately after that Kirigiri just uh, opened a portal in front of 13 and making her suck herself into the of course the black hole. After that Aizawa you know said 13 are you okay as Araka coming closer into 13 and said she's uh, she will be all right Aizawa she's just so injured as after that Aizawa looking in front of him on Kirigiri but before you know of course Izuka and Bakugo and everyone else tried to attack Kirigiri he just teleported them away after that Aizawa you know tried to see where the students has gone but Kirigiri just teleported him into the middle of the USJ to find to fight against the villains inside you know down in the stairs as right now Izuku falling from the sky and immediately after that he got hold of himself and using of course his left side to maneuver and start uh, levitating a little bit using wind under his feet as he just levitated until he finally got into the ground. After that he said huh, well that was a hard fall but I managed to save myself. After that Izuku looking above him he see you know someone also start to fall from the sky as he see none other than of course who oh, everyone favorite character Shota Shoto Todoroki as immediately after that Izuku got hold of her using his wind. Right now they all they are on of course the mountain zone, whereas you know Shoto were in the in the normal enemy was the mountain zone. As Izuku said, "Are you okay, Shoto?" As Shoto said, "I didn't need your help." As Izuku said, "Yeah, right." Anyways, let's just go with the others. As Todoroki said, "Whatever." And after that, the villains start coming in as Izuku said, get ready, this will be a hard fight. As Todoroki said, just don't get in my way. As Izuku said, fair enough. After that, Izuku starts using his electric electricity, putting his uh, right hand on the ground, starts shooting an electricity wave on the villains, while Todoroki from behind just freezing everyone. Izuku in the end starts using his wind to push some into the others and just making them knock each other off. In the end, Izuku and Todoroki has done. Todoroki has froze a couple of people while Izuku just uh, his, his right uh, side start to of course smoke a little bit. As Izuku said, my organs will gonna stop very soon. I need some oxygen. As after that he just taken uh, an oxygen mask and start breathing. After that Todoroki said, all right let's just go with the others and immediately Todoroki start uh, walking away. But after that a villain was about to go stab her, just jump from the jump into the air and going at her to stab her as Izuku said Todoroki as he immediately taking his left hand out and shooting a, an air wave on the villain pushing him away as after that Izuku just uh, start coughing some blood as he said <laughs> are you okay as Todoroki said I'm okay but what about you as Izuku said so you are worried about me that's a, a plus as Todoroki said I'm not worried about you I'm just concerned as Izuku said yeah, whatever. Don't worry. I just need some oxygen. <laughs> My quirk is really hurting me a lot. As Todoroki said, what is even your quirk? What is your side effect? As Izuku said, oh, yeah, I didn't tell you. You see, if I used my wind side too much, 
my of course my lungs were gonna explode inside my chest but if I used my electricity too much my body will just gonna stop from working as Todoroki said your lungs will gonna explode that's horrible as Izuku said yeah so horrible and it's so painful too <coughs> anyways let's just get out with the others as Todoroki said just let me help you as Izuku said huh really as Todoroki said you're not in, in no condition to fight you will gonna die as Izuku said no I'm not gonna die as long as I can't breathe as Todoroki said just give me your arm as Todoroki just putting Izuku on his on her shoulder just to help him walk because he's quite too used a lot of his oxygen in his body at the end Todoroki taking Izuku in the, in the middle of the USJ after that Izuku seeing Aizawa of course just fighting a couple of other villains as Izuku said we need to help Aizawa as Todoroki said all right you go you go hide somewhere and I'm just gonna take care of it as Izuku said you know I'm not gonna just leave you here as Todoroki said you will die as Izuku said I told you I'm not gonna die as long as I can breathe as after that Todoroki said you will not be able to breathe after a couple of seconds as after that Izuku said well then I should use this second these second you know seconds very wisely then as after that Todoroki said you really are annoying as Izuku said whatever after that immediately Shigaraki said Nomu take care of this asshole as after that immediately uh, the Nomu going at Aizawa to of course punch him but before he managed to do that Todoroki immediately throwing a wave of ice on the Nomu freezing uh, you know the right half of it as Shigaraki looking back he see only Todoroki and Izuku standing by each other as after that uh, Todoroki said now as Izuku immediately he putting his right hand on the ground and start electrocuting the Nomu after that the Nomu just fall on the ground and start steaming as Shigaraki said what the how the hell who are you two Nomu stand up as the Nomu start to stand up but Izuku immediately throwing more electricity and said this whatever this thing it's under your control right so if I ruined his brain and stopped his brain cells from working then you will not be able to control it in the end the brain have a lots of electricity inside it you know it's working on the electricity waves so if I just ruin those little cells the Nomu will be just a, a dead body on the ground as after that Shigaraki starts sh you know uh, what they call it and um, whatever he starts getting angry saying this is not fair this is not fair starts scratching his neck and said Nomu stand up as after that the Nomu stand up but he starts you know walking a little bit uh, weird as after that Todoroki said I'm gonna take care of this you go and help Aizawa as Izuku said, yeah, I'm sure that you will be able to take care of this from here. As after that, Izuku got hold of Aizawa and said, Aizawa, let's go. As Aizawa said, no, I can't just leave mom to Todoroki here. As Izuku said, she can take care of it. Let's just go. Me and you are not in no condition to fight. And we will not gonna say that to the others. But we know that we are will not gonna, will die if we just continue fighting. As Aizawa said, I hate that you are right as after that Izuku and of course Aizawa go a little bit far leaving Todoroki behind as Todoroki starts you know shooting much more ice on the Nomu the Nomu still quite shocked by the electricity wave after that <clears throat> immediately Shigaraki said I'm just gonna kill you and after that I'm gonna crush that asshole of, of your friend as you know Todoroki said I wish that to see you try and also he's not my friend after that, Todoroki is throwing a wave of ice on the Nomu, freezing the Nomu. The Nomu start breaking the ice and going right on, of course, and, and none other than Todoroki. In the end, the Nomu was about to touch Todoroki and got hold of her face, but she immediately making a wall of ice in front of her. But this, uh, of course, the Nomu just smashed the ice and got hold of her head, as he immediately smashed her head da down into the ground. As Todoroki starts, you know, coughing a little bit of blood because the Nomu holding her from, of course, her uh, behind her head. As after that, she said, damn it. As she tried to freeze the Nomu hand, and she actually managed to do that. As she immediately just breaking it, and the Nomu start to 
you know, regenerate his hand after a moment, you know, Todoroki just get for a go a little bit behind. After that, the Shigaraki said, uh, The Nomo, you can't defeat the Nomo, he's having three quirks. And you, these regeneration is one of them. So, do whatever you want from damage, he will just gonna heal. As Todoroki said, I wish that Izuku was here. And after that, Izuku said, Oh, really? As immediately Izuku coming closer and dashing behind Todoroki as he got on the, of course, the back of the Nomo and putting his hand on the brain as he said, Let's see how you're gonna survive this as he immediately start engulfing his right arm with electricity and his hairstyle to you know to fly a little bit you know going up a little bit like Aizawa normally as after that Izuku shooting a strong electric wave too much that Doroki should have you know made a wall of ice in front of her to protect him herself after that Izuku just electrocuting the Nomo more and more as in, and he see that the Nomo still surviving so he even throw more electricity in the end the Nomo, you know, head immediately just explode and all his brain cells and the, of course, the controlling device of uh, Shigaraki behind, uh, inside the Nomo brain just destroyed as the Nomo just fall on the ground like uh, just a corpse, a dead corpse on the ground and Izuku behind his back as he just standing up while his uh, right half just uh, steaming and his clothes start to be ripped off as Izuku taking a deep breath and said, <laughs> That's... <coughs> It. This is painful, so painful. As after that, Izuku just fall on his face. Shigaraki seeing the chance, he said, uh, "You brat!" As he immediately go and Izuku to touch him. But before he managed to do that, he immediately, Todoroki shooting an, a wall of ice in, behind, in front of Izuku, protecting him. As after that, she's standing in front of, e, you know, start to freeze uh, Shigaraki hand. But Kirigiri immediately managed to teleport to Shigaraki away behind Albert as they of course Todoroki said stay away from him as Shigaraki said eh, this is not fair this is not fair as after that All Might come smashing through the door and said I am here as Shigaraki seeing this he said eh, Karagiri take me out of here we already lost the Nomo as after that Karagiri just teleporting Shigaraki away and after that Mo of course uh, Mo <laughs> Shoto going on Izuku to see if he's okay as she said, Izuku, are you okay? As she go to touch him, but she immediately being electrocuted. He, she said, ouch, this is hers. I, I, is, is, are you okay? As after that, uh, Todoroki said, he's so hot. Maybe I should freeze him a little bit. As she just uh, freeze the ground uh, under Izuku and put some ice above him so she can, you know, uh, make his uh, heat level go a little bit down. After that, All Might come closer and said, what's happened? young Todoroki as Todoroki said he he used his power to defeat the Nomo and but he's right now unconscious and he might be dead as All Might said well we should take him out of here as All Might just uh, got hold of Izuku uh, regard, regardless of the pain of the electricity that is being you know right now being electrocuted of course All Might feeling the, uh, the electricity that going through Izuku body right now in the end all my just giving Izuku into the infirmary or you know the uh, people to say you know help him after that we cut into the hospital as Izuku you know sitting on a hospital bed and said uh, where am I as after that Izuku looking on his left he see All Might as All Might said ah oh, young Midoriya welcome I'm I'm sh I'm so happy that you are still okay as Izuku looking on All Might and said huh who, who the hell are you? As All Might said, as All Might said, I'm um, Young Midoriya, it's me, All Might. As Izuku said, yeah, All Might, I really don't understand who are you. As after that, Bakugo come rushing through the door saying, Deku, how the hell you tried to take the, all the fucking fun for yourself? I'm never gonna forgive you. As after that, Izuku looking behind All Might and said, Who's that fucking angry Pomeranium? As after that, of course, Bakugo said, What the fuck did you just call me? As Bakugo getting rushing and of course, Izuku, but All Might getting hold of him and said, uh, Well, yeah, of course, Bakugo, we, I hope that we should, you know, talk a little bit. Can 
genuinely, you know, just uh, having some conversation with, with each other. As Bok said, we can talk later, let me just blow the shit out of his face. As after that, All Might said, just let us talk. As after that, Bok said, fine. And after that, All Might just taken, of course, <laughs> Bakugo outside of the room. As Baku said, so, what's wrong? As ba All my said, well, looks like that young Midoriya has lost his memories. As Baku said, what? As after that, I, you know, Baku said, all right, stop acting, All Might. Was this kind of a, some sort of a prank? As after that, All my said, no, I'm serious. Looks like Izuku has lost his memory. I doesn't really know how or why, but he lost it. As after that, the door opened up, revealing the recovery girl said, Well, can you please, you two boys, come inside and let me show you something? As All Might said, Alright, recovery girl. As the recovery girl, kind of, you know, just taking All Might and Bakugo inside, and after that, she, you know, take take them into a little bit uh, far place from Izuku, because it's a big room, it's not just a small. As she said, Look at this, All Might. You see, Izuku normal, you know, normal side uh, drawback, as we, you know, know, is it actually if he used, overused his left side, his uh, lungs will gonna get explode, but if he lost his, you know, used his right side too much, his organs will gonna get stopped. Yes, that's what we thought, but looks like he's not only stopping his organs, but also his brain. Looks like his brain has lost a couple of, you know, brain cells, or some brain cells has start being electrocuted from the strong electric shock that Izuku has thrown on the Nomu, which is resulting in him ruining some things in his mind, and you can say that he lost his memories, as after that all my Baku said, So you telling me he overused his fucking electricity, and now he doesn't even remember himself? Fucking asshole, how the hell am I gonna tell his mother about that? As after that, all my said, "Well, recover, girl. Is there some weird, some ways for us to make sure that Izuku is gonna be, you know, go back into how he was before?" As recover, girl said, "I don't really know, but um, maybe if you showed him some places, old places that he might remem remember something in them." As Box said, "All right, I'm gonna take him out of here." As after that, Doroki coming through the door and said, "All might is is Izuku okay?" And after that, Izuku seeing, of course, Todoroki in front of him, as he looking on himself, of course, because he have a mirror by the side of him, as he said, Oh, so you are my sister? As after that, Todoroki said, y your, your sister? As after that, Todoroki, you know, Izuku said, Yeah, both of us have uh, half white hair and the other half is just colored, so you must be my sister, right? As, of course, she just looking on All Might and said, all Might, can you explain to me what the hell is happening here? As after that, All Might said, Long story short, young Midoriya here has used used his electricity to defeat the Nomu and looks like his memory has been lost. As after that, Todoroki immediately said, What? You say, you saying that his memory has been lost? As Bug said, Yeah, but I hope that I can get his memory back so I can fucking blow his face. As after that, uh, Todoroki said, so, can I go with you? As Baku said, why the hell you want to go with me, I see hot? As after that, Todoroki said, well, I owe Izuku my life, he actually saved me, so, at least let me help. As after that, Todoroki said, alright, it will be useful to have someone to stay behind of him and s make sure that he will not gonna run away. And after that, Baku come closer into Izuku and said, alright, you coming with me, half electric boy? As Izuku said, where are we going? As Bakugo start dragging Izuku while Izuku being dragged on the ground. He's, you know, Baku just dragging Izuku from his, uh, of course, clothes. Uh, while Baku, you know, he's just being dragged on the ground. And Izuku is looking in, fr in front of him, seeing All Might. As he starts waving to him and said, see you around, uh, smiley trash bag. I really doesn't remember your name. As after that, Baku, All Might just looking at, uh, of course, Izuku. While Baku just drag him away and Todoroki by his side as recovery girl said so uh, do you think this is a quite a good idea as all my said well what Bakugo right now has said is just bullshit but I choose to believe in him uh, I'm really worried 
we will gonna lose right now Izuku and I doesn't even know if we can get his memory back as you know recovery girl said come on have faith Toshinori you are the symbol of peace in the end have faith in yourself and your student I'm sure that Izuku will gonna go into his normal self in no time as after that Bakugo is still dragging Izuku but Izuku decided to walk with him as he said so uh, uh, angry Pomeranian where are we going as after that Bakugo said call me Bakugo as after that Izuku said all right Bakugo Go. Where are we going? As Baku said, we will going where is everything just begun. As after that, Izuku said, so you you are gonna take me into the beginning of the life? As Baku said, hell no, I'm not talking about that beginning. I'm talking about the things that, that uh, the place that started everything between us. As Izuku said, so you're you're saying that you are my boyfriend. As Baku said, I'm not gay. Look, just go with me. As after that, Baku just got a hold of Izuku's shoulder and said, all right. So you are a gay, right? Does that mean that I am also gay? As Baku said, you're not fucking gay. Stop saying this. You are getting people to look at us. As after that, Todoroki, you know, chuckled to herself a little bit, thinking that is actually so funny. <laughs> but more than normal, as to Izuku just looking at her and said, what are you laughing at, sister? As Todoroki said, I'm not your sister, as Izuku said, then tell me, how the hell do we have the same colored hair, as Todoroki said, I mean, look there, All Might having the same colored hair as Bakugo, as Izuku said, huh, after thinking about it a little bit, that's actually true, hey Bakugo, as Bakugo said, yeah, what, a, what is it, Deku, as Izuku said, is All Might is your father, as after that, Bakugo immediately stopped in his way and start getting angry, as Baku said, Todoroki, get him out, get him, I'm gonna fucking blow it, fuck it, Todoroki, get hold of him before I fucking blow his face, as Todoroki said, alright, and after that, Todoroki immediately getting hold of Izuku and start dragging him, as Izuku said, so, you didn't tell me where are we going, as Baku said, fucking shut up, why the hell you are not shut shutting up, you are much more annoying than when you were when you're having your memory, oh, I hope that you will gonna get it very soon, I'm not gonna take this bullshit, and after that, Bakugo finally got into the forest, as he used to, you know, stand in front of a, like a log, say, that right now stuck between two... You can so you can say that there is a log between a river as Izuku looking down seeing the river under them or it's kinda a little river or like a lake as Izuku said huh this is a weird place why did you get me here as Izuku you know Baku said we go come on let's walk through let's walk on this fucking wood as after that Baku start walking in front of Izuku and immediately they stop in the middle of the way Izuku right now between of course Todoroki behind of him and Baku in front of him as Izuku said why did we stop here as Baku said for this as Baku immediately just jumped down into the river as after that Todoroki said are you okay Baku go as Baku said yeah I'm okay but I think I need help, as after that Izuku said, help yourself, as after that Baku said, come here and help me or I'm gonna come to you, as after that Izuku said, ah, fine, as immediately Izuku just going down and uh, start, you know, was about to give a hand into Bakugo, but immediately he stopped and said, wait a minute, this place, as Baku said, do you remember this place, this place where we first met, when you helped me to stand up and after that we decided to become the number one and two hero, so, do you remember anything? As Izuku looking left and right and after that looking at Baku as his eyes whitening and said, I, I, I doesn't remember a fucking thing. What the hell are you talking about? Just get your shit and stand up. You're not a girl. As after that, he looking above and said, no offense, sis. As after that, Todoroki said, I'm not your fucking sister. As after that, Bakugo said, all right, I'm gonna stand up. As after that, Bakugo stand up with a smile on his face as Izuku said, see, that was easy, right? As immediately he being meet up with an explosion into his face, knocking him immediately off. As Todoroki said, we're trying to get his memory back, not make him lose more. As Bakugo said, I just couldn't handle it anymore. Let's just take him back into his mother house. As after that, Bakugo carrying Izuku on his back, getting into Inko house. As they just put him with Inko, Bakugo explaining everything to Inko. And in the end, this is gonna leave it off, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Tell me what you think about this part and what do you think will gonna happen in the next part. Well, I have nothing more to say than Severed was here.